The pendulum is a great tool for beginners and if it's something you feel drawn to. Now, if you're starting to not calibrate it, I would take this as information. It's not working for you anymore, so it's time to move on. Just like the summer song that you loved and played for months on end that you were really into, now is starting to just not give you that same feeling anymore and you're looking for new tunes. Same thing with the pendulum. What it's really showing me is for you, it's time to move on. Now I'm going to dive deep for a second here, specifically for you, but some of this will also apply to other people. Here's what I recommend you do next. Get a journal, notebook, something where you're writing by hand. It's really essential you're doing this by hand. And I want you to explore automatic writing. First, this is going to start with just you free writing. You get out your notebook. You get out your pen. You just write, write, write. You let the words pour out. Julia Cameron, who wrote The Artist's Way, talks about morning pages where you write three pages a day where the first three pages you just let the words flow and then somewhere between page two and four, the good stuff starts to come out. Once you start doing writing a lot, whether you want to call it automatic writing or free writing, they're different, which I'll get into you'll start to find that sometimes the words will come more easily. So you're going to start with free writing, just putting whatever ideas you have on paper. Then what I want you to do is whatever question it is that you're asking the pendulum, put it at the top of the page. Should I stay with so-and-so? Is this relationship over? Am I kidding myself? Whatever it is, I don't know if it's about a relationship. Now, maybe it's about career. Maybe you're really frustrated with how your boss is teaching you and teaching you, treating you. And honestly, they probably are a jerk. So maybe it is time to move on, but you're not the type who just wants to like, Oh, jump jobs right away. Or maybe there's like five things going on. This is what I feel personally for you is happening to me. It feels like personally, there's so much happening for you. The immediate, when I tuned into your question, the immediate feeling I got was she almost feels like the walls are closing in. Things are really overwhelming. There's so much going on. And it, it's almost as if this is being short circuited because there's so much energy pouring through you, charging through you. You're so activated that it, it's almost like frenetic, intense energy. So in addition to writing, if you haven't already done tapping, I really recommend tapping. One of the things I love about tapping, you mentioned grounding in one of your comments. Tapping really helps you to get your your nervous system regulated to get calmed down to get mellowed out so you may want to tap about the pendulum itself or you may want to tap about whatever question it is that you're working with in your life look up videos on here of tapping i've been doing it a lot lately with my kids and i, I don't want anybody to think you have to change your life in a day in the most overwhelming points in life, sometimes the only thing to do, the main thing to do, the best thing is care for yourself. Get your body in a calmer state of regulation and then you get to decide, do you pick the smallest, easiest thing to resolve first, so that's one less thing, or do you hit the head on thing that's creating the most emotional turmoil, problems, whatever, and figure that even though it's the biggest, once you address that, uh, the, the ripple effect will will go all over your life you get to decide again don't take that the pendulum isn't working for you as a problem it's just you moving beyond that tool being the one that works best for you for right now it may work again for you in the winter time or in the springtime or in a few months from now but right now you're at a point where it's not the best tool for you and it's time to move on so with automatic writing, as I said, start with the free writing and then you write your question, whatever it is. Let's say it's about relationship. Should I stay with him? And then what I do is I get quiet and I tune in. This is after I've written a few pages just to get all the words out, all the thoughts out. And if you want to write, like let's say a relationship is what you're asking the question about. If you want to write as many pages as you can, this is how I feel. This is why I think I should stay. This is why I think I should go. This is what makes me mad. This is what I can't stand. 
this is what's going to happen if I go. I'm afraid if I leave, this is going to happen. I'm afraid, whatever, all of those things. And then letting it all out, letting it all be seen, letting it all be heard, getting it out of here, out of your heart and your head onto paper gives you that objectivity, gives you that distance. And then at the top of your paper, give me guidance on what I should do about this relationship. And whatever way you interact with, God, spirits, angels, the universe, whatever, let yourself receive, feel like I'm ready to hear what you have to say about this relationship and then let the words flow. You may, for automatic writing, some of us, we just take to it right away and some people it takes a little bit longer. So feel free to try it every day. So let's, I'm assuming you use your pendulum quite regularly and now it's not working. I would start trying automatic writing instead seeing if it works for you and and as i said doing more things that also support your nervous system grounding free writing tapping staying calm and and knowing that there's nothing wrong with you if it doesn't work for you anymore as i said it doesn't typically work for me i will sometimes use it but it's for whatever reason it's just not my thing i don't make it mean anything and that's the other bit it doesn't mean anything. I love black olives. My husband hates, well, he likes black olives, but not Kalamata olives. He, he will not eat green olives. Do I make that mean anything? Well, okay, he has bad taste in olives, but it's just a personal preference. It, in the grand scheme of things, not a big deal. Same, I, I, I love that this helped you, and, and you can say thank you to your pendulum and put it aside and be like, it's time for something new. You have grown as a person and you're dealing with more now than you were before so it's perfectly good and a great idea to care for yourself to love yourself and to meet your needs right now in this moment all right for you and everybody else if you want me to make another video about automatic writing i'd love to dive into that and if you have any other questions comment below